This video is for Roblox users who are trying to run the game and it simply isn't responding. There have been a lot of updates with Roblox's web client version recently and users are running into a lot of issues trying to boot up the game. So I've compiled a list of solutions to help you out with that problem. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure that this is a client-sided issue and not Roblox itself. Sometimes Roblox's servers go down, and that could be why you're unable to run any games, why you're unable to log in. So we're just going to ensure that this is a client-sided issue. You go onto Google Chrome, you just type in Roblox status, like that, and you click on the very first link. You should see a green bar that says all systems operational. That means that Roblox's servers are up and running, and this is an issue with your client, your machine, your computer. And we'll work on the next steps to figure that out, but if this is a red bar, if there's some kind of issue that's currently going on with Roblox servers, you don't need to worry, just let them handle it, let them take their time, and they will fix it up for you. So the very next thing I'd like you to try is to run Roblox as administrator. So once you click on uh, your search bar right here, you type in Roblox, your Roblox player should show up, this app right here, and you want to click on run as administrator, just like that, just click on yes and Roblox should run as administrator. And then you can log in and hopefully that fixes your issue and Roblox boots as normal. If not, you can try something more drastic. You can try uninstalling Roblox, the application. You wanna go over to settings. You wanna click on apps right over here, installed apps. And you wanna type in Roblox yet again. You see right here, you click on that and uninstall. Once you do that, Roblox should completely uninstall off your computer, right there. And then you want to reinstall Roblox. Go to Google Chrome, type in Roblox, download, just like that. Download Roblox, download Windows app, and it should re the installer should download. Just open that, give it a second while it downloads Roblox, and hopefully this fixes your issue. Sometimes um, Roblox's files get corrupted during updates, things like that. So running a clean install of Roblox could help you out, could stop your problems. Let's see here, Roblox boots as normal. This could help you out. If not, we'll try something else. So another thing you could try is installing Roblox directly from the Microsoft Store. Sometimes the web client version is currently down, isn't functioning. There's some kind of issue with the with the Roblox themselves. Their update isn't nominal, isn't functional. So you can try their Microsoft Store version. Just go there and you type in Roblox. And it should be this one right here. Click on that. And you should be able to install it. And this is the Microsoft version of Roblox. Not the web client version that I just showed you that you download from Google Chrome. This you can download from the Microsoft Store, just as I've shown you. And this could potentially solve your problems. It could make it so that um, Roblox starts working again. See that it downloads, and then you can try it, and it should help you out. If not, then we'll move on to the next thing. Another solution I can offer you to your problem is to try to reset your settings on Roblox. This solution has helped me a lot in the past, and it could help you as well. If you hold the Windows key and press R on your keyboard, a little run window should show up, and you want to type in app data, just like that, and you want to press OK. This will open up your files. You want to head on over to local, scroll down until you find Roblox, right there, and you want to delete this thing that says global basic settings. You want to get rid of that, and then you want to relaunch Roblox and see if it works for you. This method has proven to, to help some users before. It's helped me a lot in the past, and I hope it does the same for you. If not, we'll move on to the last step. Final solution I'll be offering you today is something that I have also personally wedded myself, seeing that it actually helps me. Um, if you head on over to your Windows search bar and you type in disk cleanup, just like that, this thing should show up. You click on that and it should bring up a disk cleanup. You wanna go over to your disk that has Roblox on it and you wanna delete all of these cached files, you don't need these anymore. You simply delete all of them. And uh, one of these should be thumbnails, especially this one. Thumbnails, you want to get rid of that. That is what causes Roblox to crash quite frequently. So you press OK and you delete all your cached files. You're not deleting anything important. These are just memory files that your system stores for update purposes, for diagnostic purposes. You don't need these anymore. You clean it up, you get rid of it, and it should help Roblox boot up perfectly. I hope this video has helped you. 
I hope my solutions have, have alleviated any frustration you've had with Roblox recently, and I'll see you guys another time.